Hello there, you guys. So sorry about that. Um, when I started talking, this thing speeds up. Do you guys see that? Because it, it listens to the microphone. Um, welcome on back, you guys. If you guys are just joining us, welcome on in. Um, I time traveled. <laughs> I did it. You can see over there. We're currently set to today's date and moderately to today's time for me. Hopefully this goes okay. I'm a little bit scared. We are, CC. We switched over. We're just gonna be doing some dailies. I'm a little bit scared. <laughs> I'm scared to turn on the game. Okay, we got this, you guys. We got this. Rosa, hello. How you doing? Okay, you guys. I'm so scared. Let me know how the audio sounds, by the way, when we get in game, because... Doddles, I'm doing things. Thank you. <laughs> Miss Mocha, very nice. How are you doing? Hope you had a good day today. Okay. We have grass. This is good. DB is still there. That's also good. Um, and I see a fossil. This is good. Okay. Are they gonna call me time travelers? <laughs> oh gosh, this is this is interesting to me though. I've never time traveled really much before, as you guys know, so this is all still very new to me. Yep, that that looks right, right? <laughs> Ew, Phoebe need <laughs> Rude, poor Phoebe. One of those days, oh, no, I feel you. I feel you. I was having a little bit of that this morning, but I'm doing okay. I think, you know what, for me at least, it's just been, like, super windy here. So, I didn't sleep very well, and I was just super tired. I still am, but I have no energy drink, so. Okay, she didn't tell me anyone moved out, so this is also good. Are we safe? Did I do a thing right? Oh, yeah, I'm still wearing my socks. I have my umbrella from yesterday. Awesome. Let me know how the audio sounds, you guys. Is that too loud, too quiet? Switch between tools so you guys can have a better... Just suddenly carrying an axe. <laughs> oh gosh, what do I have here? Oh, my boots, right. I'm keeping my, my rainbow socks on. Audio's perfect? Great, thank you. Want to make sure you guys can hear the game, because I like New Leaf soundtrack. I think it's fantastic. A little nugget. Yesterday's stream... We did our very first slumber party Sunday, so we just did visiting Viewer Dream Towns all day, and um, the day before that, I just did viewer visits and dailies, I think. I'm gonna put the axe away so that Random doesn't get any ideas. <laughs> but yeah, now you guys get to see um, the grass for yourselves in your own games, which is really good. Tatum, hello. We only just started. How are you doing? We were uh, we were playing Pokemon before this, and I just switched over to Animal Crossing. So, was Pokemon a figment of my med yes? We didn't do those battles or anything. No. We switched over very suddenly. <laughs> From Midge, dear Crystal, thank you for coming to my house the other day. It made me really happy to see you were having fun. Also, I really wanted to give you this. Do you like it, your friend Midge? cube howdy crystal you know what furniture you sent me i'm not sure where to put it on the left or the right i keep moving it around which is making me sleepy this is for you oh we sent him the cube clock do you guys remember that because i wouldn't give him something i think i wouldn't give him the mario shirt it is so much better than the snow <laughs> you miss the snow crunch it, it sounds kind of quiet doesn't it without it vintage camera and an old sewing machine. My villagers are giving me, like, retro stuff. Oh, dimples. Again? <laughs> Tatum, pretty much we're just gonna be doing dailies today. Um, just super chill stream. Maybe some Desert Island Escape. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Um, we'll see how I'm feeling. I've been live for just over two hours. Which I usually only do two to three hours. But we'll see how things go. Also, Bob, hi. Oh, sweet, sweet. Hey there. So anyway, what's up? Um, it's room inspection time. <laughs> Let's head over to your place and see how clean it is. Let's go. Makes you happy? I know, I was catching butterflies for the first time on this save file the other day, which is weird to think, because we've spent so much time and so many streams in this town, and I hadn't seen grass in this town yet, and it's really weird to think like that. Snooty, they do until you see areas that aren't dirt. If you see it just grass with the with the tiles, they look really good. 
I need to. <laughs> this room is not final, you guys. Please ignore it. <laughs> Hope this doesn't sound weird, but your house smells great. Thank you. Yes, Miss Guided M. Yes, we are currently on the 25th. We're currently on the correct day, which is actually kind of like a weird weight off my chest. I was always so aware of how forward in time we were. Show him the ghost train. Okay. Bob, look. Oh, he actually looked. <laughs> Bob is great. Ace Girl, hello. How are you doing? Welcome on in here. Don't mind me, if you want to guzzle some hot cocoa- Oh, I- I don't like saying cocoa, that sounds weird to me. Hot chocolate, please. <laughs> just pretend I'm not here. Ace Girl, we've been live for just over two hours. Um, I only just transitioned into Animal Crossing. We were playing Pokemon before. This room is tiny. I don't think he thinks much of it. <laughs> it's awesome that you have a Wii U console. <laughs> If you play every day, I bet you I could get as good as the pros. Bob is gonna be a professional, professional gamer, you guys. <laughs> Look at him creeping. <laughs> but babe, isn't he a cutie? Look at him. I, I kind of want him to change the shirt, but other than that, I'm pretty happy with how he's looking right now. Are you gonna put anything up on the walls? Okay, so he's gonna want to send me something for my walls when he uh, sends me a letter tomorrow. Ace Girl, um, if you see behind Bob over there, there's a Wii U item on the floor. You can get that from, um, shoving me. You can get that from, um, uh, either Timmy and Tommy's fortune cookies, or you can get it from scanning in a villager or a, an amiibo who has an RV and purchase it from their RV. Um, and that's how you play Desert Island Escape. Joke! <laughs> Raindrop Crossing, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Why are you gonna put anything up on the- Okay, now he's still talking about my walls. Cool. Simply press Bob. <laughs> I'm- I'm really sad that my simply- or that my uh, my Bobby mode isn't on right now. It's it's being moved down tiers. I should mention once again, you guys. So that's why it's not currently there, and I feel really guilty. Grumble, grumble. <laughs> Whoops! There goes my stomach alarm. It's time for me to get going and have a snack. Later, sweet sea. Thanks for having me over. No worries, Ace Girl. No worries. It's a really fun game. Definitely would recommend it. Okay, back to doing dailies. Oh, hi. Hey, I had an idea. How about commissioning a bo How about how about that rose arch though? Not the ballooned one. Gianna, hello, how you doing? Welcome on in here. I'm sure everyone would love it, including you, sweet C. Will you think about it? Well, at least we got a public works project suggestion, because we haven't had one in a little while. <laughs> Not exactly what I wanted, though. The flower one would have been prettier. Although, you know what, though? They're really hard to place down. Unless you have, like, a one wide pass somewhere. They're really kind of weird. <laughs> I always have to do that. <laughs> Darn it, cube. So close yet so far. You know, he tried. He tried. Fossils. <gasps> Oh, I forgot he's wearing this shirt, you cutie. <laughs> Look at you. And he's carrying his little watering can. Do you guys... Uh, show of hands, guys. Who in here remembers during my old playthrough of Rosewolf when Gaston was watering my flowers? Because, oh, that's when I fell in love with him, you guys. <laughs> Tatum, yes. <laughs> Lucky just suggested the balloon arch to me yesterday. I think they took cute. They look cute in park area. Oh yes, no, they they definitely would. I've never actually used it, I don't think. You remember me? <laughs> Gaston is such a sweetheart, you guys. Sometimes. Are you any good at catching bugs? It's pretty much the best. Except for one kind. I really want a mole. <laughs> oh wait, I have one in my storage. 
I got you. I got you. It was the one that glitched when I was visiting... Is it Pepper's town? I was visiting someone's town. And the, the bug was... Mole crickets are supposed to be ones that you dig up and then catch, but this one was just above the ground. Gianna, not at all. Not at all. Of course I remember it. <laughs> He was so mad that he got hot. He like ran off. It was so cute. I have a mole cricket. See? Look, I kept it. I don't oh. I was keeping it because it's like it was a, it was a glitch, but I do have the clip of it still to prove it. Should I give it to him, you guys? Uh is it Sloney Baloney? <laughs> Hello, how you doing today? Welcome to the stream. Oh, Ace Girl, honestly, I just plant trees anywhere. I I, I want to, like, tear them all down and start fresh, personally. Um, just random placement. Should we? Okay. Gaston gets the glitch cricket. <laughs> Anything for Gaston. That was so funny. And we we have the clip. I, I can prove it. It was so funny. It might ruin his perfect house. It's okay. What do you mean his perfect house? He has a terrible house. Gaston. Are you hiding back here? He's like, I, I don't want to see her again. Gaston's home is going to sound lovely, probably. There you go. There's your cricket. That seems kind of fitting to give it to him as well, because you're right. Random, his house is going to sound really weird. Oh, misguided M, yeah? Give me a tricycle. <laughs> I'll take it. Gosh. Oh, Julian is also watering flowers. Sorry, Julian! Colton, I've seen Julian yesterday and I just- I couldn't stop thinking about it. Jeez, I'm sorry, Colton. My apologies, my friend. You're kind of daring today in your classes. Thank you. I need them to see. Maybe it's because of those black frames? Or maybe it's because you're just so daring. I don't like it when they kind of flirt with you. <laughs> is, there a, is there a balloon somewhere around here? I'm assuming I can hear one. Are, are you guys having an issue up there? Does Gaston need to help you sort it out? He will. He's a good bun. Oh, why am I still carrying this? Whoops. Let me go fix that. Oh, snooty. Well, I hope you're enjoying your day today. Okay, I'm just gonna put away the uh, umbrella because I don't, I don't need it right now. I forgot I was carrying it. There we go. I still need to find a better closet than that one. That one's the first one. I think it's the first thing we ever bought from retail. Because <laughs> it was the only one available that day. There we go. Okay, so... Um... We have hybrids down here. At least we should... Yeah, I think I'm gonna start trading these out for yellow and red and red and whites for these ones. But we're having good luck with the purples, so that's really good. Fanciest thing I've ever eaten. Oh, I don't... I'm not sure. I'd, I'd say something from when I was in a resort at, or on a resort at, in Mexico, but I, I couldn't name just one thing. <gasps> no. Deep fried ice cream. Because <laughs> for me, that's fancy. It, w it was at a fancy restaurant, but like, it was really, really yummy. Yeah, and I've been pretty good. I've been pretty good. Um, It was super, super windy here last night. I know it's actually been windy for a lot of people. Um like East Coast US as well as as well as Canada so um I didn't sleep very well last night just because of the the noise wearing socks in the sand yeah Dre I know but the rainbow socks though okay I'm just gonna put these down since I'm not gonna be using them I guess 
I think I'm gonna have too many oranges and not enough pinks <laughs> from the looks of it. Yeah. Oh well, I tried. You just feel cozy? Oh, it was just loud. And it wasn't like the sound of the wind, it was like the sound of things being blown around. Also, I'm gonna sneeze, give me a second. Sorry about that, you guys. I didn't want to blow out your eardrums. Oh! <gasps> Is it big enough to sit on now? Did the bricks change? I think they might have changed, you guys. Also, I'm out of space for purples. Um, <laughs> I need to find another place to put this. I'm gonna put it here for now. I can sit on it? We'll sit on it at the end of the stream, you guys. We're gonna have, like, a milestone stream or something. Um, I just put the purple here too. I don't know where I'm putting these. And I'll put the yellow right here. <laughs> this is a mess. Oh, no, wait. I'm gonna... Oh, I wonder if I have any spare reds. I'm gonna snipe this yellow. No, I don't need a yellow. I need a white. I need white, yellow, and then two reds. The wind... Hit me up last night too and it got cold. Yeah, it was pretty cold as well. Which wasn't so fun. Um, I guess I can just put it right here. Summer here in New Zealand and I hate it. All I want to do is snuggle up in a million blankets and I can't- I'm looking forward to summer. You can- we can trade. We can trade. I don't want to be snuggled up. <laughs> oh, what? Oh! I didn't see that there. Awkward. Yeah, no, probably not today. Um, I'm gonna be playing again tomorrow, and then tomorrow I'm probably gonna be um, having people over. Um, today we're just gonna be doing our dailies and hanging out. Um, do you guys think I can... I'll just, I guess I'll just put the ones that I have for now down here. So I have... Yellow, and I have one white, and I'll just put the reds when I find them. Uh, is it Casey Janet? Hello, welcome to the welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good day today. Thank you so much for coming on over from YouTube. You want cold weather? It's too hot in southeast of France for forever. I, I will trade with you gladly. Please take all of our gross snow and cold and grossness. <laughs> Uh, there's the link to the Discord if you need it. I healed Prince. Um, so Colton we've spoken to. We haven't seen Midge. We've seen Cube. Like the Australian summer, but without the huge beast-like spiders. Oh, yes. <laughs> I've heard all about those. Also, guys, feel free to let me know if you see any fossils that I'm missing while I'm- like, I, I look over and talk to chat as I'm walking and that was, those are, like, you know, probably the times where I'm gonna miss a fossil. Is that our first clover patch? Do those pop- like, do those spawn in the winter? Does anyone know? Oh, Eric, why are you still wearing that shirt, buddy? Your house is so cute, but that shirt. I'm a fossil, does that count? We found you, random. We got you. Uh, I can't remember doing anything special to take care of my azalea bonsai. But I seem to have done a good job of raising it. Watch as that's one of those, like, plants that you don't really have to do anything to and they just kind of flourish. <laughs> and he's just, like, thinking that he's doing a super good job. Oh, I need to go to- I need to go to the island today. I want to pick up more, uh, if I can, I need to pick up more, um, bushes to fill out this area, because we're not done. Are you hiding back here? <laughs> that is a grape shirt. It is, and I don't like it. I'm sorry, monkey. Lately 
I've been totally into home decorating shows. I'm thinking I could make my room a whole lot happier by adding something new. If you bring me something that would fit in well, I'd really appreciate it. Do we have anything that would fit? Her house is blue. <laughs> Uh, the tricycle would fit better in, like, Bob's house, or one of the Lazy's houses, I think. So I'm not gonna give her that. <gasps> CC, very nice! Fossils... Or, not pitfalls, I guess. Gyroids, anything. Let's see how Astrid's doing. <laughs> Oh, Andrew. Oh my god, that's adorable. <gasps> Random. Random, we need to have a discussion. Oh no. <laughs> if anyone doesn't know what's happening, Random dresses all of his villagers in Eggman jackets. And he left this really nice- I, I admit, the color is nice, the light blue is nice, but he left one in my town in re- or in the, uh, the Able Sisters. And the first villager to put it on... Oh boy... What are you wearing? <laughs> oh no! She looks stunning! I- Low-key, it's better than the grape shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Holy snail, we only just started. We're still in the middle of dailies. How's it going? And Dimples, I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, I've heard you have something pretty nice, Crystal. Well, I'd be up front with you about... How about... Oh, oh, actually, they'll fit in really nice with your house. Go ahead. I want an Eggman jacket. <laughs> So, in Rosewoof, actually, I think Gaston and Melba were both wearing, I think, the red Eggman jacket, and it was so funny. First member, Astrid, yeah. Did she just take something out or put something into her pockets? I saw her do a weird movement. It's almost what a marching band. A little bit, a little bit, yeah, I could see that. Well, it's better than that crepe shirt, I guess. Sounds good, Lucas. Sounds good. So now you can just relax, chill out, hopefully. Alright, well at least you're still wearing your your normal shirt. I was guessing it was going to be Phoebe who put on that shirt first, not going to lie. You can pick up dust from a carpet using tape. Pick that tape down, peel it off, stick it down, peel it off. Keep going until you zone out. It's a good way to clear your head when you're riled up. I mean, not gonna lie, when I'm riled up, I tend to just organize and clean, so that actually is a real thing. I don't know about taping your carpet, though. Would have laughed at Phoebe. That would have been perfect, especially because they're both in their houses and they're both acting kind of funny. That would have been hilarious. I don't think there's anything there. Oh gosh, Snooty. <laughs> Oh, Rain's World, very nice. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I hope class treated you well. There we go. See if there's any fossils. No. You love grape juice? I prefer the... Um, from what I've had, at least, I prefer the, the lighter, like green. If you know what I mean, grape juice. I don't know if there's a proper word for it. <laughs> it's just different kinds of grapes, I guess. School is good. Awesome. Awesome. Alright. Blue rose today, you guys. Anyone think we'll get it? Oh, red, 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 and more red. Okay, nothing. <laughs> I'm not having good luck with this. I'm half tempted to start all over, but... I know it's just pure luck. Oh, there's something else I need. 
Everyone's wearing a Mario shirt? I mean, that's not a bad one to wear, though. <laughs> oh, well, you guys, I, I'm... I've never really had the best luck with blue roses in the first place, honestly. But I'm not really in a hurry. I'm in no rush. I will get them eventually. It'll happen. This is nearly done. This area is really kind of cute. It's very vibrant. I'm probably going to expand it to be all the way out here as well. But for now, it's good. No, CGW, the only way you can get one is from those, like, hybrid red roses. Notice this year's festival is next week on March 4th. It's almost here, so just wait a little longer and then get ready to celebrate in style. So, you guys, the plan, if you guys are not aware, my birthday. I feel kind of weird saying it so, like, so much. I feel like I'm repeating it too often. My birthday is, uh, this coming Sunday, March 3rd. Um... So the plan for that day is I'm going to be playing a whole bunch of different games on stream. It's going to be a really long one, but I'm definitely going to be playing Animal Crossing um, for my birthday celebration. And then we're going to be time traveling a day ahead. <laughs> oh, hi, buddy. To celebrate with Festival. Lately, I've been hearing people calling you Deary. <gasps> Do it. Yes. <laughs> yes, go ahead. I did, Rainsworld. We did just at the beginning of the stream. I... Uh, wanted to make sure that I wasn't on my birthday already because I would have been today. Um, the DS was saying it was my birthday today when it's not, so. Well, Andrew, it's a good thing that, uh, we'll be celebrating on that Sunday then. <laughs> Oh, holy snail, good luck. I hope it goes well. More power to you. Job interviews are never, like, no matter how many I do, I never, you know, am not nervous. Because <laughs> you have school on Monday? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Sometimes you have to <laughs> I'm travel a little bit to make sure you're able to play on those event days and stuff like that. Well, actually, I guess I found all my fossils, didn't I? Cool. Make sure there aren't any flowers over here. No one in the campsite. Awesome. Ooh. I'm so happy that this is fully grown now. Um, do you guys want to help me out with my um art from red today, by the way? You guys know the answers, feel free to let me know in chat. What did you do before for a degree that was ages ago and I don't really know what to expect? Yeah. No, I mean, you know what the good thing is? The more that you interview, the theoretically better you're gonna be at it. The wave one is real. Oh gosh, you guys are already on top. So you guys are saying that this one is real. There's this one with the finger guns. I remember that. I think that one's fake. There's this one. I don't know what's fake or real about that one. And this one, it's something to do with the color of the, of the thing. <laughs> oh gosh, this be scared. <laughs> the waves one is real, you guys? Which is, what is this one? Dynamic. Okay, I'm not gonna buy it. Um, when we go turn in my fossils, I'm just gonna make sure that we don't already have it because someone might have gifted it to me, like one of the villagers. The statue's hair is too- oh, okay, neat. Okay, so that was called dynamic. I'm gonna go check and see if maybe they, um, maybe we've already donated it? He's supposed to have, like, flayed hands. Okay. Um, so it was dynamic. We already have the dynamic one. So thank you guys so much for letting me know which one was real. Unfortunately, we already have it. We're going to continue to run into that more and more. Which kind of sucks, but... 
Oh, Rain, congrats on getting stitches. I know he's a very popular villager. <laughs> well, maybe maybe we'll get a fossil that we need today. You never know. Go. Okay, so he didn't have one. No worries, monkey. We'll see you later. Merman, it's very, very useful to do that. I didn't know that originally either, so I just buy paintings and then not know whether or not I had them already donated until he told me I had. Um, so I wasted a lot of bells doing that. Um, definitely recommend checking your board um, if you're ever not sure. And it works as well because, you know, your encyclopedias, for example, they automatically register whenever you catch something, but maybe you accidentally sold it or you accidentally released it without donating it first. You can tell by comparing it to the uh, the list of stuff for the museum. Oh, and Jess Rules, thank you so much for uh, letting Casey know about the Slumber Party stream. So, just to just to reiterate for sure, um, those will be every Sunday, with the exception of next Sunday, which is my birthday. So we're doing something entirely different. Um, we started that for the first time yesterday, and people seem to really like it, and I enjoy doing it, so we're definitely going to do a lot more of those. There we go. Um, we're still looking for something for Blue Bear. I don't see anything in here that I really want to get her, though. You share a birthday stitch is very nice. Brains World, I I'm probably am. Um at least for me. I know I know spring can kind of almost like mean different things. Oh gosh, I forgot to grab a fruit. Um spring can almost like mean different things for different people. So for example, where I am in Canada, we literally have like a day of spring and then it goes from like cold winter to like really hot summer. So in the spring, I usually wear hoodies and stuff like that for that reason. So I'm probably going to keep the hoodie for a little while. I might change the pants. Um, I just haven't found another pair that I actually really like. <laughs> um, but I, I will be changing for sure. No one shares a birthday with Emma like Gaston. <laughs> of course not. That's fantastic. With Rod, yeah, Rod. Rod's a cool villager. I've said this. I feel like he's come up in a couple different streams recently, which is kind of interesting. Um, he's a villager who I really wanted for a while, never had the chance to get. So, okay, I'm gonna update my dream suite for you guys. I always. Try. It's like my new goal to update it every single time I play on or off stream, just so that you guys have the most like up-to-date version to visit if you would like to. Rod's a pirate? Yeah, he's pretty cute. He has like the cute little headband and everything. Rain's World, not today. Not today. Um, I will be playing Animal Crossing Leaf tomorrow, and I will be doing um, viewer visits tomorrow, so. At least, I plan to. <laughs> Uh, Rainsworld, you can type in exclamation mark DA into chat to get my dream code. Oh, thank you, Misguided Emma. <laughs> and thank you guys for visiting. Much appreciated. Um, okay. I'm trying to figure out how to say this. G GX? I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to say your name, but welcome on in here. Thank you so much for coming on over. Duddles, yes we can. We can indeed. Yeah, Dimples, neither do I, which is why Rod is kind of a weird villager for me to really like, but he's a cutie. He really is. Uh, 
All right, Shrunk, I got your snack. I'm glad you guys are enjoying Desert Island Escape. I remember one of the first times I streamed that. Everyone was so confused and no one was really into it. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, I guess I just won't stream this. But it's, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. 39 degrees Celsius. Oh, Casey, I am so jealous of you. It's cold here right now. I have my window open because I was boiling in here earlier, but now it's cold. <laughs> I really should get up and close that. Gage. Okay. Um, try and remind me. Um, I don't want to, like, butcher in the future, but I might forget. So just keep reminding me if, if you find that I'm not saying it correctly. Like, if you come back for future streams, I'll probably remember for today's stream, though. But Gage, welcome on in here. Showmanship joke. You know, back when I first made my debut, there was a catchphrase that I always used during every show. Back when all I could think about was getting people to actually remember my name. Today I'll share that catchphrase with you, so listen carefully. Keep your eyes on me and remember it. Are you ready? Here we go. Look at the hunk. His name is The Shrunk. It didn't win me any fans for some strange reason. I love it. Feels like summer. So let me let me check what temperature it is for me. It's pretty bad. Like it's not as bad as it has been, but it's currently negative four Celsius. Feels like negative eleven here. So Oh really, Miss Goddam? That's kind of that's kind of cool. We had we've had record lows this year for uh, for us Canadians here. It's not been nice. <laughs> also, sorry, Abby, I missed your question earlier. Desert Island Escape is a mini game that was um, included with the Welcome Amiibo update. It's really fun. I can definitely show you if you're interested. It's not the police station? Oh boy. <laughs> Afraid, how come? How come? Does anyone know what's wrong if I plant fruit trees they grow, but if I try and plant cedar saplings? Um, Casey, you can only plant cedar saplings on the top half of town, like, kind of close to the train track areas. If you plant them down low, they'll, they'll wilt and they won't grow. I assume that's probably your problem. Too warm, can't wait till winter. <laughs> oh, Merman, I'm so down. I'm so down. <laughs> you can take it. Let's see if we can find anything for... Oh, right! Jam Poodles is still being worked on. Uh, let's see if we can find anything for... Blue Bear. I want something for Blue... <laughs> this is not... Nothing here is for her. I need something blue. It's okay, Casey. Like, you know, I, I've, I've seen a lot of stuff over the last year that I haven't seen before playing New Leaf, and I've been playing it since it came out, so it's, it's a little bit crazy how much new stuff there really is, or stuff that you might not know about. If they're too close to the river? Yeah, I think the river might be the divider, give or take. Was the couch there? I think- was that a regal couch? I could've- I might have miss- miss saw that, I'm not sure. Speaking of cedar saplings, though. No worries, Pepper, not at all. Yeah, I think it was the regal couch. I'll go back and check for you, but I'm pretty sure it was. Um, so, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is. Well, just triple check. Regal sofa. I, th I should be fine, Pepper, but, you know, if you guys need to go, that's totally fine as well. I think, I think we have everything. It's a pretty chill, quiet stream today. Not sure, Snooty, not sure. I'll go home. <laughs> And 
here's that shirt that, uh, <laughs> that, uh, Astro is wearing. Just a bell pant. Oh, I want these. I prefer the blue pajamas. I like the color blue better than pink, personally, so I've been, like, low-key collecting the pajamas. No worries, doubles. I really like the regal furniture, so... Nice, Lucas. Very nice. This reminds me of random. <laughs> That's a really weird thing to say when I think about it, but it's true. Get the festival clothes. I already have them. I already got them. So we are, we are set for festival. I have the dress and the headpiece. Apparently there aren't any shoes for it. I'm Oh, I can just wear my rainbow socks. That's what I'm gonna wear. <laughs> Confirmed. And I don't want any of those. Cool. Yeah, Rain's World. I think I got the dress when I was playing on a day that I wasn't streaming it. And I got the head the headpiece another day, I believe. I could be wrong. Okay. Um cool. I'm gonna go put these away. I always forget that I can just access my storage right here. I usually go running back to my house. Oh, nice merman. I personally am not a huge fan of wearing the hat, <laughs> but I like the uh, the clothes. So I think I have it somewhere in here. Yeah, there it is. So I'm gonna keep that separate actually, maybe. Um put it down here for now and then trees I'm putting here and fruit I'm putting there Andrew I'm not quite sure yet um just because it's it's gonna be the birthday stream where we're gonna be doing like a whole bunch of other things I'm not sure how much time I'm gonna put into the festival itself but I guess we'll see and if it needs to be done we can always like the next day we can play Animal Crossing again and just go through festival for a second day. No worries Zoe, Zoe. I hope you had a good day at school. Um no one's in here. I'm gonna get my coffee if you guys feel like helping me out with our orders as usual. It'd be much appreciated. Can't do it, Snooty. Can't do it. <laughs> Look at my little socks, you guys. Look at them. Little rainbow feet. <laughs> I love it. Actually, is it too late? I know that he has like a cutoff time. I could be wrong. All right, no, okay, cool. Okay, just good luck. I I want to do that. I'm just waiting to get the golden axe. Oh, no one wants coffee like Gaston, you guys. I forget what he likes. Um, is it Blue Mountain? No one hits the friends of the hammer like Gaston. Lately, flighty one, hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good one. Is it Blue Mountain? Lots and lots? Is it really lots and lots? I think I remember being surprised about that as well. I'm gonna trust you. I'm gonna trust you guys. <laughs> and there is grass today, yes, the snow is finally gone. There you go, Bun Bun. Here we go. Whoa, that's good stuff. You know, you make a fine cup of joe. In fact, you may even surpass Brewster, or is that overdo it yet? All right, see you later. <gasps> Cube. I forget what he. I know what Eric likes. I don't know what Cube likes. Does he like the same thing? Does anyone know? 
minimum wage service worker. I know, and we don't even really get paid for it. You just get given coffee pants. Brewster is shook. More male hairstyles. I'm not really a big fan of uh, a lot of the hairstyles in New Leaf, unfortunately. Blend a little bit, one spoonful, really? I thought he had like really sweet. <laughs> There you go, buddy. Now now watch him try and take a sip, you guys. His little arm doesn't even reach up to his face. Look at that gap. <laughs> yes, that's the stuff. Coffee is like magic. Don't forget how you made it. Gonna forget in two seconds. Baby. They don't do curls, this is true. Curls are like longer hair is like a no-no in this game, apparently. He just pours it down himself. <laughs> he needs a straw. <laughs> oh gosh, Phoebe, I don't know what your usual is. Was it Kilimanjaro? I don't remember her thing, guys. Kiliman oh, I got Kilimanjaro right. See, I'm I'm kind of remembering the beans, but not everything else. Give him a bendy straw. <laughs> oh, Snow, you just brought back let's just really vivid memory there. When I was a kid, I had a plastic, like, reusable twirly straw. So it was like a straight straw, but then in the middle it had a twirl. And I had two. One of them had a Pikachu on it. Like, it was a, it was a legitimate little Pikachu figure that was, like, holding onto the straw. And I had another one. I don't remember what the other Pokemon was, but I, I distinctly remember that when you said Bendy Straw for some reason. It's probably because we were playing Pokemon earlier. It was Pikachu and someone else. It might have been like Charmander or something. Those were a nightmare clean, yes. <laughs> Doing this totally from memory. See, I see what you did there, random. <gasps> KK! Okay, I have no clue what he wants. But we had three because three kids. I had two. I think I I think my parents got two, just like in case I had a friend over. But I had a friend who broke the figure off one of the straws and my dad was like super upset with him. Oh gosh. Blend no milk and... No milk or sugar? Really? So he, he doesn't mind having the same for both? That's weird. KK, hey, hey, put some clothes on. <laughs> I agree, he should be wearing a shirt or something. It's a little bit strange. <laughs> I just realized we're wearing matching glasses. Cool. <laughs> Any crossing, no worries. How's it going? <laughs> Customers have all been taken care of. Good work. That was KK Slider, or DJ KK in this game. Welcome yeah. back, hello, how are you doing? <laughs> Hipster nudist lucky, I was a little bit weird. He's also like incredibly tall. It's weird seeing him standing up and it does make me kind of feel kind of weird. Ooh, we're getting an extra item today. <laughs> Cream and sugar, cool. Awesome, I'm gonna go put those away. Uh, Annie, I'm glad you had a good day back. I'm glad that you're not like, you know, while I'm back at school. Cause that's probably what I would be like. Normal KK back and not DJ. I, you know what? Wasn't the hugest fan of the DJ thing, but I, I really do like um, how they did, like, you know, there's DJ KK most nights, but then on one night a week, he does his, like, you know, like, acoustic show and, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. 
Oh yeah, Ace Girl. They they added a lot to the to, with the update. It's pretty cool. Just want the roost back. It I agree, and I just I like having the roost outside, but I also loved having it in the museum because it just really fit there. I'm gonna go put that away. Oh, I guess I can go down this way. Why is he not recognized? I mean, maybe people are just trying to be polite? I don't know. Alright, no worries, Dimples. Hope you have a better day tomorrow. Oh boy, Annie. <laughs> Um, I'm just gonna... It's a way like that. Perfect. Um, who haven't we seen today, you guys? We haven't spoken to Midge or... Midge or Kevin, I think, are the only villagers that we're missing today. So I'm gonna go see if we can find them in the museum, and then maybe we'll do some Desert Island Escape. Oh, slightly. No. Um, this town was created... Uh, I believe it was the 26th of December of last year, so it's it's very new still. Um, I started over after taking a little bit of a break from the series, um, just to get myself hyped for Animal Crossing on the Switch. Okay, let's see if we can find them, you guys, because I haven't seen them all day. <laughs> yes, Boxing Day! <laughs> Which, it's coming up for its two-month anniversary tomorrow. Um, anyone in here? I know Astrid likes to hang out in here, but I guess I've already spoken to her today, so... Leftover sandwich day. <laughs> Someone tell him to stop. <laughs> Yeah, Adam, I'm I'm hoping they kind of... They could do a lot more with the Switch, let's put it that way. That marketing. I mean, it's sad because we only the only thing we have to go on is literally an image thing 2019. And we're all really excited, so that's absolutely crazy. I'm really, really excited to see when they actually show us gameplay, how crazy the community goes. No worries, Dimples, no worries. Staring away the dry dishes so I can start washing. He's a pain at times, but he's low-key pretty awesome. Don't tell him, though. My lips are sealed. He will not hear a thing from me. Where are my villagers, you guys? <laughs> Learning how to use the safe editor to kick out those pesky... Oh, Annie, nice. Good luck with that, man. I'll make sure you always have a backup save and all that jazz. The museums. Yeah, they, they do a good job. I always like walking through the museums. Hey, Phoebe's here. And and you're here. This is not who I want to talk to, though. Be hard. <laughs> Wireless headphones. Oh, you're you're pulling my trick random. That's what I do. Miss Mocha, I'm hoping that's the case, because, like, normally you can't have multiple save files of Breath of the Wild, but if you have a second profile, or me, then you could. I found that out early on with Mike. So it'd be really handy if we could do that, and I'm hoping I can have multiple towns on the Switch. Oh, there's Midge. Found one of them. I'm here to say how fossilized plants and animals differ from modern ones. I only wish there was more here. I am nearly done this museum, how dare you? <laughs> we are nearly done in here. Backup of the save from her original 2013 town. We got it back for her and she's- Oh, that's amazing. That's awesome. Snooty rude. 
Science teacher is trying to make me do a dissection in bio, and I don't think they let me do an alternate. Ooh. I, <laughs> I, I opted out of sciences when I was in high school um, because I took a computer science course instead, which is an alternate, so I avoided all dissections, and I'm very happy about it. Where are my villagers, you guys? We're still missing Kevin. <laughs> Pepper, I know. I know. Where is it, man? Maybe I missed him. Maybe he's in his house now that Phoebe is in the museum. Because she was definitely in her house earlier. Maybe retail. I'll check there first since it's on the way, but... I need to fix the trees in this area. They get, like, stuff got knocked out when I put in this fountain, and it's not quite what I want. Maybe I'll do bushes in this area, actually. I'm not sure. We'll see. Sounds good, Pepper. Wait, see if anyone walks in, because sometimes they do after a minute. He's just the only unknown original left. He's little- oh, maybe he is. <laughs> so cute. Jenna, you're getting tired? I feel you. Not sleep well last night. Um, he wasn't in the roost. No one seemed to be in retail. Phoebe's not in her house, so maybe Kevin swapped with her. Oh, hi, Blue Bear. Um, no. He's not in his house. Okay. I don't know where Kevin is, Um, but I'm going to go pop over to the island really quickly, see if we can pick up any more of those bushes, and then we'll we'll, uh, we'll head back and play some Desert Island Escape, if that's cool with you guys. The claw machine is pretty cute. And Cupcake Crazy, how are you doing today, by the way? Kevin's where- maybe that's where he's gone. He's, like, changing into the jacket. Cathario, hello, how are you doing today? Welcome on in here. And while this is going on, I need to text Mike. Sorry, I don't usually check my phone during streams. Image most of, I remember I still have the uh, the pictures of it. <laughs> Lydia, hello, welcome back. Traveling alone, eh? That's the life. Free as a seabird. Just really tired. Yeah, I feel like everyone's just having kind of a tired off day today. It's going pretty well. Yeah, I know that he likes coffee, so that's probably the way to his heart there. Three weeks after I put it there. Yeah, like it hasn't been very long. <laughs> it is Captain, yep. Yeah. Oh gosh, give me a second, sorry. We are good to go. Alright. Bushes. Yellow. No, it's red. I guess I can buy red ones. I'm not gonna put them where the yellow ones are, though. I'll just buy some red ones while I'm here. I've been getting these medals for a reason, I guess, right? If you guys have any good suggestions on where to put the, uh, the red ones, let me know. Oh, really, Andrew? That's not so good. I hope everything, uh, 
goes well and your your results and stuff like that don't suffer too much. Oh gosh, Annie, that's never good. I'm glad that he uh, had your back for that though. I've lost count of how many I've purchased. <laughs> section by that well yeah I'm hoping that it doesn't distract too much from the fountain in that area if you know what I mean it's the fountain yeah I have the fountain in front of the town hall I think so I'm put this wind on 12 was still wearing that pizza and I cannot so yeah I know exactly what you mean yeah no it's absolutely crazy and apparently it's supposed to be like a little bit less intense today but I'm still hearing stuff blowing around like no tomorrow and something hit my window. <laughs> okay. I don't know if you guys heard that. I hope it wasn't too loud. So I bought 10. Do you guys think I'll need more? I might need more. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Super picky with your paths. Good art. I've tried two copies. When you had in Rose, when they're like, oh, I'm glad that you uh, you got a path that you really like. That's fantastic. Return to the window cake. It sounded a lot more solid than the window cake. Um. <laughs> uh, is it Shadia? I don't know if I'm saying it right, but welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for coming on over, and uh, I'm glad you're enjoying the content. Just a flying. It's probably like. Something like just blowing off someone's balcony, honestly. The best was one time we had a storm here that was very, very nasty. It was like one of those really sharp, intense, short storms. This is a couple years ago now. It's probably actually more than a couple years ago. I was in high school. Um, and all of a sudden, I look out. And I see, if you guys know, like, those plastic white, like, lawn lawn or pool chairs, I just saw one just kind of go sailing by. <laughs> it was that windy. Like, stuff was getting blown everywhere. And we have, like, an outdoor pool nearby, so that's probably where it came from. Close enough? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm terrible with pronouncing anything. How much do we have now? That's probably enough. As much as I don't get enough by, like, one. <laughs> Dish be That's true, the cake could be frozen. Always happens during geography. <laughs> the peanut butter sandwich is stuck on the window, wow. <laughs> Oh, Dimple's nice. That's good. That is really good. Sassy Simmer, hello. How are you doing today? Welcome to the stream. Are you romantically involved? Oh boy. Captain, please. Cathario, yes. So, um, I explained this earlier, but not everyone was in here, and that's totally cool. Um, the Bob Love emote used to be a tier 2 sub. It was only for people who subscribed at that $10 level, and I always said if I ever get more emote slots, I'm gonna put it down to tier 1 so that more people have access to it, and I'll put something else in tier 2. So, recently Twitch has opened up the affiliate program a little bit more, so you have more access to more emote slots. So, I moved Bob Love down to tier 1. But to do that, I had to delete it and then re-upload it, so Twitch needs to re-evaluate it, which is kind of annoying. So it's going to take a couple days, at least. Um, I also have a new emote for Tier 2 and Tier 3, which I've never had before. Um, I'm really excited to show them to you guys, but I'm not saying what they are until we actually get them. Um, I'm hoping that Twitch is- they seem to be really fast with accepting other people's. I hope that they're as fast with accepting mine. Um... But yeah, I'm, I'm hoping it works out. Um, I do this now? I could do these now.
I, I'm sorry for like the kind of um I guess like inconvenience almost there I feel really bad like I didn't want to delete it I was trying to find a way that I could just like move it but they don't let you Watch this all the link between worlds but you might play Animal Crossing Leaf. Well, I, I really want to try Link Between Worlds, so I hope you're enjoying it. Um, Animal Crossing is also a very solid game, though. <laughs> oh, TK, I would not be cool with that at all. <laughs> Do not want. Um, How many spaces is this one? Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, does that fit perfectly? It fits perfectly. Okay, it's meant to be. Where's my axe? <laughs> it's very fun. You know what? I've it's ridiculous. I've had it for the longest time because it came bundled with one of my 3DS XLs. When you guys start playing some old, um, I already have been because with the the Switch they have the classics, um, things so that I can actually play older games now. It's pretty fun. Um, I also have the SNES and the NES Classic as well, which have a couple older games on them, not a lot. Gdex, how are you doing today? Um, just rules, there should be- I think there's like a little icon that you can choose to get notified when I go live. Um, you don't have to, like, subscribe, you can just follow for that, I think. Oh, whoops. Okay. Sorry, trees. I love you. It has to happen. I'll replant you elsewhere. Andrew, just in a minute. When I'm done with this, definitely. Bob moved out. Judex, I'm so sorry to hear that. Sucks. Um, and just this last one. This area looks so empty without the trees. I don't like it. Oh, jeez. Okay. I feel about how it looks because you can't pass in front of entrances and it looks really weird around rivers. I, like, if you look down here, I avoid rivers. <laughs> I purposely, like, you know, try and limit the contact with, like, edges and stuff like that. Um, I personally love, you know, um, paths, but it just, it helps me organize my town, I guess. Also, oh my goodness, Casey! With that tier one sub, guys, can we get some love all up in chat, please and thank you. Hopefully, Casey, you should have access. Let me let me go find someone else's heart emote, because I don't have my own at the moment. I'm gonna spam Dazzo's here. There you go. <laughs> um Hopefully you should have access to the Bob Love emote shortly. I'm so sorry for that delay though. Casey, thank you so very much. That's much appreciated. As a love. <laughs> okay, did I count these right also? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Wait. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Guys, sorry, remind me. Could I have a row of 12? Or was it 11 and then the 12th one will... Um, Wills, does anyone remember? Because that might cause an issue here. And also, can I have it this close to the well? I guess that's my next question. <laughs> can I actually do that? Goldie the dog, hello! Thirteenth, Will Walt. Okay, good to know. Cool. I don't think I even have that many, but this is fine. And I'll just start picking up the peaches as I get rid of these saplings, because I don't have room. There we go. There needs to be one empty space between the well and a tree bush. Okay. 
Um, I am going to... Is this an empty space right here? Does this count as an empty space? <laughs> that probably doesn't count. I need to have it, like, there, don't I? I mean, it's not the end of the world. It just kind of sucks. <laughs> so, like, here is gonna be fine, I think. That kind of blows, but that's okay. Uh, and change the dine in that same slot where the path is. Will the path change? It'll change. Um, so it's really useful if, say, for example, you put down one path and then you put down or you change the design slots to a different path, but just make sure that, like, for example, if I go into my design slots here, if you put a corner piece um, in the same slot as the previous corner piece, everything will change and look great. It's, it's a nice way to be able to easily change your paths, essentially. Oh, whoops. So I think this is safe because I can put one there. <laughs> I could, Andrew, I could. I've changed that well twice now and I feel kind of guilty. Either way, for now, this will do. You know, we'll, when, when everything's fully grown and everything's kind of set in this area, maybe I'll take another look and see if I can change something, but... can't plant trees bushes next to public works projects without a space between them, but you can plant trees right next to the plaza. Yeah, it's kind of weird, isn't it? You're absolutely right there. No worries, Andrew. No worries. Take your time. Take your time, I'm still figuring out this area. <laughs> uh, so it's gonna be something like that. This this is kinda of bothers me, I'm not gonna lie. We might end up changing that to something else. But this is okay for now. We'll deal. <laughs> um hopefully it I, I hopefully it lets me plant that there. Yeah, Duddles, can't you even plant these without holes? I usually do the whole thing anyway, just to make sure I know where I'm putting it, if that makes sense. There we go, got a couple more. Oh, that's perfect. Nine of each. Nice. Gaston, what are you doing, buddy? Um, so I just need four more. Let's go see if I bought enough, you guys. Red roses to keep it a color? Yeah, I can do that. I can do that for sure. We have a lot of excess red roses hanging around for some reason. A oh, sassy, thank you. Thank you. We've been working on it for, um, actually just about two months. Um... Did a lot of plot resetting to get everyone to move into the right places, which was really annoying, but I'm happy that everyone's settled now. You don't actually dig something up? Yeah, that's always the worry, of course. Okay, um... Oh, did I move? I got rid of my watering can, didn't I? Of course. I bought more than I need? Awesome. I prefer to have more than less, and then I can just, like, put them somewhere else, for example. Cool. That's great. Okay. It's still kind of bothering me that we haven't seen Kevin today, though. Uh, uh, Sassy, so... 
If you look around the villager houses, you might notice I have a path or a design down. It's uh, this grass one right here that has a very mean title to it. Just want to put that out there, just in case anyone goes to download it. Fair warning. Um, but you can see I also have them kind of interdispersed around town. And essentially the idea is that after the Welcome Amiibo update, villagers will not move on top of paths or designs. Um, so if I put these in town blocking off any 3x3 three three place, which is how big a villager house is, um, it prevents them from moving in anywhere that doesn't have space. So I put down areas that had 3x3 three three spaces designed for my villagers, just kind of lead them into the right positions almost. Um, it's really annoying, it doesn't always work properly, but... Annie, I don't think villagers get sick anymore after the Welcome Amiibo update, as far as I know at least. Could be wrong. But yeah, no, um... I need a link to my guide on how to plot reset. It, it's a really useful way to get villagers to move where you want, but it's very time consuming. It can not work out right. Yeah, misguided M. I, uh, I feel like I need to explain that, because it's not mine, right? But uh, just in case anyone goes to download it, it does not have a nice name. <laughs> there we go. Um, and for now... I'm just gonna put, like, two perfect... Perfect peach trees here, just to fill up that gap, because it's a little bit obnoxious. Cool. Um, let me put these away real quick. Dazzle, which ones do you think will die? Because we weren't sure exactly. I have to move out to do that? Yes. No, it's a little bit time consuming. I did it right from the beginning in this town. So I kind of, I, I forced everyone out with amiibo. It was really mean, but it worked. There we go, so we have two extras. A couple of those. Couple of those that are really extra. There we go. It wasn't anything serious and they heal anyway, yeah. I it took me a long time to realize that they actually removed it in the update. Um I just didn't realize it at all. Oh, the square. I didn't know that. Hopefully they all they all work well together. I guess we'll see. Go. No, I need one more red one. I'm going to see if I can like snag one from somewhere. Um, I don't know if I have any spares lying around for once in my life. Any red ones back here hiding? No? Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna steal one of these. There we go. Castor, are you trying to blend in, buddy? Oh, you cutie. <laughs> There we go. And then hopefully tomorrow we should have some more, like, proper hybrid roses. And I still haven't had any luck. Not with these. These are fine. Did I water those? I did. Um, with these over here, I'm trying to get orange, orange lilies, which I think are a thing. But I haven't been having any luck. Okay, guys. Do you guys feel like Desert on Escape now? Are you guys ready for this? Because I've been saying we're going to play it soon, and I just kept getting distracted by flowers and gardening. Die, die, die. 
Okay. Um, who should I bring in today, you guys? We have Bob. Does anyone have any other villager species suggestions? Not specific villagers. Something like a bear or a horse or a sorry frog. Any suggestions, you guys? Because I do have the amiibo book. <laughs> we could pretty easily select one or an NPC or an NPC. Sheep, owl, duck. Or <laughs> I'm seeing so many different suggestions. Maybe I should like actually give you guys like options. <laughs> We try Stomper for the rocks. Tom Nook hunts. What do you mean hunts? He like goes out on his own or? What's on the menu today? <laughs> oh gosh, no, no guys, not specific villagers. <laughs> oh, you know what? I don't know if he's in here still, but I did have someone in particular who's been asking for one particular villager, and it's one that we haven't actually tried yet, so... Dizzy. We're gonna try Dizzy. I don't know what he does, but we're gonna try it. I want to try villagers that I've never- like, species that I've never brought before. Um... What else haven't we brought, you guys? I don't think we've done frogs. Um, who else? We haven't done gorillas. We have a good number here, you guys. I think people say frogs. Right, who do I? First frog I see is Wart Jr. Not happening. Um. Have a whole bunch of non frog villagers, of course. We haven't had a sheep yet. This is also true. That's also true. Um, I'm kind of leaning towards sheep, I'm not gonna lie. Um, sheep? Any sheep? Why do I not have any sheep? First sheep I see is in. I don't have any sheep in the back. Muffy? You guys want Muffy? Man, I don't... You guys know my feelings about Muffy. I could use her and we could hate on her. What does Muffy do, you guys? Those are formerly known as Prince. I have Timbra and I have Muffy. Which one are you guys? Muffy or Timbra? I have both. I'll let you guys decide. I just saw Muffy is good and then Muffy sucks right within like a comment of each other. I'm seeing more people say Muffy. I don't really like her. But I'm gonna trust you guys, all right? Everyone to know you're all being trusted. <laughs> There's gonna be that one person who's gonna be like, I told you she was terrible. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. And once again, if there's anyone in chat who's new and has no clue what Desert Island Escape is, please let me know so that you're not sitting there really confused. Oh no, Pepper! <laughs> Please don't stay up too late, you know. Try and be quick. <laughs> I feel bad. Okay, intermediate level six, you guys. This is a weird shaped island. Okay. All right. Um, I don't know who's best to start with, so I'll just scan them in and see what they all do. Want to make a new group? All right. So, Desert Island Escape is a mini game that was introduced on the Welcome Amiibo update. You can get it from playing a Wii U in-game. It's a new item. Um, the whole premise of the game is in the title, essentially. You have to 
bring three villagers to an island, you have a set number of days to escape. Um, you have to find materials to create a raft. At the same time, keeping your villagers fed, as well as keeping them protected from, like, enemies and stuff. Dynako, thank you very much for that host. Um, it's really fun. Really, really enjoy it. Oh, Merman, thank you. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. You'll pick it up pretty, pretty soon, if you see it. Trenton, hello, how are you doing? Fearless, okay, so he's, he's one of the ones who's really good at fighting. First aid. Does this sound good, you guys? Do you think this is a good order, or should I have Dizzy go first to fight off any enemies? No, random. <laughs> it's really cool, Alfred. I really like it. Ellie, hello! Welcome on in here. How are you doing today? Dizzy first? Alright. And I I guess Muffy last. I don't know. I'm indifferent. <laughs> Let's see how this goes, you guys. You hate Muffy? I'm not a big fan of her either. <laughs> yeah, they can all see the same distance, so. Okay. So we have nine days to get off the island. We have to find three logs and a mast. You can see all that information up above. And we have three days worth of food left. Let's send Dizzy out, see what we're working with here. Right off the bat, we find string that can be used to make a couple different tools. Sleeping, welcome back. How are you doing today? And we found a stick, so we can now at least make a fishing rod. Oh, and because he's an elephant, he can stomp rocks. So that's going to be useful for this island, I believe. Okay, next up we have Bob. Um, he's really good at fishing, so we'll see if we can find any fishing spots for him. So... Beehives. We have the chance to get honey from them. We could also get stung, or we could break the, the honey hive comb thing. Um, so we're just gonna leave quietly, because maybe we can come back later with a net and actually have a chance of getting honey. Oh, Julian, we play it almost every time we stream. It's a lot of fun. Muffy first aid can sniff out nearby medicine and treat own injuries immediately. Can use food to treat injuries at camp if needed. That's going to be pretty useful, I think. Um, let's have her... You can't really reach anything right now, can you? <laughs> let's just have her go up here. Um, let's... Do you guys think we should go to the left, go up the center, or go to the right? I think, I think Dizzy, if I move him here, he's just gonna break, like, everything around him, which is gonna be pretty useful. Um, so let me know. Also, Ellie, thank you very much for the follow, much appreciated. Go left, you guys think? Sounds good, Rainfall. Good luck with the homework. You can go left and go around. And it seems to be like there's multiple entrances into this area. Okay. People are saying left. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Also, Ellie, thank you very much for the host. Okay, so we can make a tool. Um, Using that stick and string, we can make a fishing rod. Which is going to be really helpful if we find fishing spots. And because Bob is a natural fisher, if he has the fishing rod, he has a 100% chance of getting some fish. Thoughts, you guys? Should we make it? Should we wait for something else? We don't have to make anything. Also, Jillian, thank you very much for the host. Also, uh, Emily, welcome back. How's it going? Because he's a kitty? Yes. <laughs> You guys think we should make it? Okay. Go ahead and make it. And it also means, because the other two aren't natural fishers, if they run into fish, they also have a chance of catching. It's not 100% guaranteed, but they at least can try. Also, okay. Is it just me, or does Muffy look incredibly vacant when she's just staring at it? 
I just- I can't get over her face. Oh gosh, no, no, Dizzy, don't stomp up. I thought he was gonna bring down the structure, that would have been horrifying. Um, <laughs> okay, there's our first log, so we need two more of those in the mast. Maybe random, maybe. <laughs> maybe we could just accidentally leave her behind. So he's gonna be super, super useful for getting through this island, I think. Um, let's move him up to this space here. Muffy's eyes are pretty weird, <laughs> not gonna lie. Uh oh. Okay. So, Dizzy is fearless, so he's really good at fighting these things. He has more than a 50% chance to win, so I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try. There we go. Awesome. But she's still so cute. <laughs> We got it! Good job, Dizzy. Awesome. Alright, Bob. There doesn't seem to be any fish in the water, which kind of sucks. Um, I'm gonna send him to that center piece, because I feel like that has to be something good, right? Yeah, that's the mast. Awesome. Buffy didn't even last one week in your tent. Yeah, I, I was not cool with her on the whole. Um, let's have her grab that one down there. The stone. Okay. Um, and I guess I'll just have her move there. <laughs> um, let's. We can go over here and get that that. Uh, tower. I think I can have Bob reach that tower, actually. We'll have Dizzy continue to, like, stomp around here. <laughs> the wave. I'm kind of- I'm not gonna lie, I've never really had elephant villagers before, but Dizzy is really cute. Maybe I'll need to look into them. Um, so we only found a rock today, I can't actually make any tools from that, so I'm not going to. Yeah, Ellie, I didn't have a good experience with Muffy either. <laughs> we also haven't found any food yet, so that's a little bit worrying. Um, let's have... Let me have him go stomp over here, I think. Just to clear the area a bit. Bob, well, we're gonna have him go towards that tower. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, maybe we're not going towards that tower. Um, so Bob has a horrible chance of surviving this, so we're gonna flee. And hope for the best. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a bad time. That's a really bad time. Bob is not gonna be okay, but at least Muffy can heal. <laughs> um, Muffy, why don't you go towards the tower? <laughs> there we go, there's some food. That's really good. That's what we needed. Decent. We can take that. Eh, do we really need to go up there or should I just go towards the tree? Do you guys think we should get the tower or the tree? Because the tower, like, I feel like we've already kind of... We've got most of this already. I'm not... I don't think there's anything over that way. tree, you guys think? Yeah, scorpions are horrifying. I think the tarantula is more scary, in my opinion. Alright, let's see what's at the tree. Gosh darn it. 
Muffy girl, you got this. Muffy, you don't got this. <laughs> oh, you sheep. Oh well, it was her last day anyway, that's fine. Um, let's... let's put... uh... Put it where... Ooh. Let's put it where Dizzy is. Just bad luck. <laughs> Should've gone up. Um, let's heal. How much food gets used up? Takes two to heal. Also, uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce the username. Leo, thank you very much for the follow. Guys, I think we're gonna run out of food. <laughs> this is not a good time. Opinions, you guys. Camp on the scorpion. <laughs> Psalm, this is Animal Crossing New Leaf. This is a mini game in Animal Crossing New Leaf called Desert Island Escape, though. I will be out of food completely. Not a good idea. No worries, Goldie. Have a good one. Heal or eat, you guys. This is a bad choice. I don't like this. This, this island has not been friendly to us thus far. We don't know if there's any fishing spots, Pepper. We haven't seen any. So maybe if I don't heal Bob, Dizzy and Muffy can go out and find food, but... Not yet, Apple, as far as I've seen, unfortunately. Jenna Joy, no worries. How's it going? I hope you're having a good one. I would have gone there eventually, Pepper. But <laughs> I... Metaton, hello. How are you doing today as well? You can save the food. Yeah. I think we're just gonna save. I'm sorry. Oh, he looks so sad. We're gonna eat and sleep. He's gonna sleep it off. And hopefully we can find food tomorrow. I don't think we're having a good chance of success with this one, though. We have not found any food. Alright. Muffy and Dizzy, I'm relying on you both. Okay, Dizzy, I'm gonna have you move up. There's stones to break here. There's some food. Let's hope. I think peaches were his favorite, or was that Muffy? No, I think it was Muffy I was seeing. That's not gonna be enough. <laughs> Okay, well, at least, at least we know now that this island is full with rocks. <laughs> and we're probably better off, um, bringing someone who can stomp through them. And scary enemies. <laughs> Let's try it. I have nothing to lose at this point. I think we're gonna fail this island for the first time. Oh, wow. Good job, Dizzy. to rest. That's fine. Okay, Muffy, where are we sending you today? You can grab this one down here. There's one up there. She could grab those two. And I don't know whether those are gonna have food on them, but I think two is probably better than the one option back there. That's a log. Normally I'd be happy to see that, but we're not gonna have enough food. This is not a good time. This is not a good time at all. I'm gonna try it. We're gonna try it. <laughs> we have nothing to lose. Muffy may have just saved us. Muffy may have just saved us. Good girl, Muffy. Okay, that was horrifying. Oh, oh, there's a fishing spot and there's medicine. That's awesome. Okay, that's good. Um, I hope that's not important. <laughs> I'm kind of skipping it.
Why does Bob look different now? Should I heal him now, you guys? We have a bit more food. No, we don't have much more food. Dizzy, I think he's a big eater, right? I don't like this. I, do, I still need to heal Bob because we have the fishing spot. Some, uh, so pretty much, uh, if you have your game updated to Welcome Amiibo, you can find the Wii U item in-game. Also, Sassy Simmer, thank you very much for the follow. Um, you can find the Wii U item in-game through Timmy and Tommy's fortune cookies, randomly. Or when you scan in an Amiibo and you go to their RV, um, you can purchase it using Meow Coupons there. Well, Pepper, he should have already rested, right? Heal him, get more food from his fishing spot. Yeah. I think that's probably the best way to go here. There we go. I th I'm hoping Bob is successful with the fish. And Pepper, the reason why I healed is because I'm not sure what those- those are different, like, bubbles coming up than usual. Sassy Zimmer, you can play this game using, like, Animal Crossing New Leaf on your 3DS, but the 3DS item in-game um, does not have this. Also, Chutney, thank you very much for the follow, but I am- I am playing this on natural, like, 3DS. I don't know, Pepper. I've never seen it. Oh, okay, no, the bubbles went away, I think. Anyway, we have medicine here, we just need food. Okay, um, I'm gonna send Dizzy inwards. Bob can grab those three things. Uh, is it simply Kuroi? Yes, I do. Yes, I do, that's the town I'm currently playing in, um, outside of the mini game. Okay, see if Bob- we have the fishing rod and Bob is a fisher. Let's see what he can do. Oh, good job, Bob. Nice. <laughs> okay, that's- that's good. We are riding on like the bare minimum of food though and I'm not enjoying this. Yeah, so I'm, no, they're actually interactable, which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's one of my favorite things. Um, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> it's okay, simply. No worries. Welcome on in here, though. Oh, I have an extra spot. Jeez, I didn't realize. There's another fishing spot. <laughs> Oh, she can reach that, actually. Let's see what that is. I do have medicine, though, but I'd, I'd rather not risk it. Also, Simply Croy, thank you very much for the follow. Hoping I'm pronouncing that right. <laughs> Muffy has a really good chance with the bees. I'm gonna try it with her. It's a better chance than it was with Bob, and we do have the medicine. I don't really want to use it, but... Good. Awesome. <laughs> that's so much better. Okay. Good Good day. Good day. Still hoping that's not important. Um, we'll put it right here, I guess. Chloe? Okay, I'll try and remember. Just keep reminding me if I forget. I'm terrible at remembering. <laughs> Is that right? No worries at all. Dizzy's gonna stomp that rock. Buffy's being a good cheap floor for once. For once. Um, let's send him down to get these ones. There we go. Actually, 
Was that the last one? I just went from thinking I was gonna fail the game in like one turn to like winning in the next turn. What is this game? <laughs> wow, cool. Yay, us. <laughs> Dizzy was a lifesaver on that one. I'm just gonna say Muffy also, like they were all pretty good. I'm just saying. <laughs> Awesome. I did not think we were gonna win that. Usually I want Bob to be in like the top spot, but Dizzy, Dizzy earned it. One day's worth of food left. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, I have to empty. Jeez, that was awesome. I'm glad we managed to get through that. You can now play on the advanced map. <laughs> no. Not happening for a while. Survivor Animal Crossing, essentially. <laughs> oh, but that was Desert Island Escape, though. If you guys have not had the chance to try it, I will always recommend it. It's a lot of fun. And as you can see, I am a new leaf, I promise. <laughs> Simply, you have no idea how happy it makes me when people recognize that. Yes, it is. Gosh, I love it. I love it so much. Oh. Were you creeping on my house, sir? Alright, guys. I think I'm seeing people saying they have to go. I probably do have to go as well. It's currently 6pm my time and I do have some stuff to do this evening. Colton is creeping. <laughs> I want to thank you guys so very much for watching for both Pokemon and for Animal Crossing Leaf. I hope you've enjoyed both. Um, if you guys just mind hanging out and chat, I'm gonna see, actually, I'll see right now if there's anyone else who's live who I might want to give a host to. Let's see if we can put some love. Yesterday we hosted, uh, Lizabelle, I believe. Uh, if there's anyone online who's kind of... You know what? I don't really know this streamer too well, but they're playing Pokemon. We were playing Pokemon earlier. Um... Thank you guys so very much for watching. I'll be back with more Animal Crossing Leaf tomorrow. We're gonna to be doing viewer visits. Um, the tree, you're right, wait. <laughs> wait, hold up. Well, oh, oh, excuse me, hold up. <laughs> hold up, you guys, wait a minute. Oh, but Red is here, he's gonna miss. We're gonna do it tomorrow, we're gonna to do it tomorrow. I want, I want it to be perfect. Anyways, thank you guys so very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.